Hey team, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will show you how to update an array value when you don't know the index position. A viewer submitted this question to the channel and I decided to make a video to answer it. Comments make us all smarter. Let's solve this problem. Let us learn a PostgreSQL update statement nugget. So I'm gonna set up the problem first Drop the table, I'm not sure where I was at. So here we have a table, months, has two columns, a country code, which is for three characters and it's the primary key, and then the month name, and we're gonna make an array. Let's, uh, let's get there. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm going to insert two values, uh, USA and Mexico. And then notice in USA, I accidentally spelled September wrong. And then in Mexico, they speak Spanish, I uh, misspelled February, Febrero. So I want to like update these with just the update statement. But let's go ahead and put this data into our database. And then notice I can select all the data from that database. And then our first statement is I'm gonna say, get the country code from the using the array position on month name for that misspelled September. Now notice, this is gonna return me a number. Now notice it returns me the number nine. So then I can say update months set month sub nine equals, notice I spelled it correctly, where USA, where country code is USA. So notice I can do that update statement now and now I can uh, notice here I'm getting it correctly now. I'm going to get the rate position for September, and it's giving me 9. And I'm looking at all the data here, and you see that September is now spelled correctly. Now I kind of gave you a hint here using this array position. The rate position kind of gives me the index. Now how can I just solve this using just the update statement on uh, country code equals MEX. How can I do that in just one statement? Not go find it, but just do it. Hit pause and give it a try, and then watch how I do it. In our previous statement on line 26, notice I'm using array position. I say month name September. It's returning me a numeric value of that index. Notice nine. Now I'm gonna use that same method and I say, hey, for the month name Ibero, that is gonna give me some number. And that number is gonna be month name sub, whatever that number is. Does that make sense? And we're gonna set that value. So this right here just gets me that value right there, which will be two in this case. And then we just do it just like we did here on line 23. We have to come up and say equals feb R-E-R-O, where country code equals M-E-X. Does that make sense? Excellent. Well, let's go look at all that data in there. Let's make sure it's still wrong. And notice it is still wrong. Let's come down to our update statement. Notice I'm going to get a the array position. And then I'm going to use the set notation. I'm going to say, hey, set that month at this array position equal this value. Let's run it. I just ran it. I got one update. Let's do the uh, search. And notice it has been updated. And there is an update nugget for the PostgreSQL array data type. And there you have a team using the array position function to calculate the array index position. If you have any questions, uh, please leave them below. Have a great week. Adios.